Hey guys, Morgan's Maintenance, and for today's Tool Talk, I've been super excited about this, been looking forward to this for a week or so now. Uh, I knew that this was coming, but I wanted to make sure and share it with you guys because it's because of you that I'm able to have something like this. But Knipix is one of my favorite tool brands by far that I've been introduced to in the last year or so. I mean, I, I didn't really even know anything about them until I watched several of the people that are on YouTube that have kind of been sharing these. And I want to say, first of all, I appreciate y'all turning on, turning me on to these because stores just don't carry these in my area. Lowe's has started carrying a few of them and then Rexel, an electrician supplier of mine, uh, they carry some as well. So I have bought some through them, but primarily I have to get them through, you know, House of Tools, Amazon, something like that. Uh, but to me, as far as for hand tools, pliers, things like that, I, they've been unmatched in my opinion compared to some of the things that I've used in the past. And I'm not saying that those tools are bad and that these are, some of these are just crazy better than some of those, but I, I feel like the performance of these Every one of them is just knocking it out of the park, whatever it's supposed to do. So it is by far my favorite, one of my favorite tools that I've come across in the last couple of years, probably that along with the Milwaukee M12 line. Uh, for what I do, you know, even though I love power tools, I love my battery powered tools. But to me, this is my bread and butter stuff right here. This is my money makers. And none of these let me down any time that I've used them really like them well you know i'm getting close to 2,000 subscribers on youtube uh basically to me i'm the biggest thing in in tool reviews to hit in the year 2022 by the way it seems like you know i'm just growing at that record pace i feel like i got some clout so i contacted knipix and the conversation it, you know it went a little bit like this just give me all the you have wait wait i worry what you just heard was give me a lot of what I said was, give me all the you have. Do you understand? So the conversation didn't really go like that. It was more like, could you pretty, pretty please, if you don't mind, I would really love some tools. If you could send me some, I'd really appreciate it. I'd understand if you can't type thing. But they have been super nice. All the conversations back and forth have been great. And then I got home today and then sure enough, there it is, Knipix Tools to Mr. Morgan. I had this box on my porch. Been looking forward to getting this. I have no idea what is in this box. Uh, you know, they kind of asked if there is there some empty spots in your tool bag that you'd like to fill. And there are some tools in particular that I'd like to have, but maybe some of those are some that I already have. And I, I kind of just decided, you know what, I can't pick, you know, because there's so many of them that are on my list of some things I'd like to have. I, I'm not, I don't want to pick. I kind of told them what I do. And I said, why don't you just surprise me? I, I want to be surprised. There's nothing that they could possibly send me that I'm going to look at and say, I have no use for that whatsoever because, you know, I, I do a whole lot of different things. And at some point in time, I will be able to use whatever's in here. So I decided I'm going to open this up along with you guys. Uh, again, I have no idea what's in here. You're going to see at the same time as me. I probably won't put chapters in this video so that you won't see something scrolling across the bottom to, to give away the surprise. Maybe a few days from now after everybody's watched it or so, I might go back and put some in. But I'm just going to open the box and reveal the things in this video. I'm not going to go in great detail about them because I'm going to probably do reviews on whatever's in here over the course of time and get into the more finer details of things and how I use them and things like that. So I'm going to open them today. We'll reveal them. I'm going to put them in my bags, going to put them to work. Uh, but I'm super excited about this. I can't imagine another company uh, out of all the companies that I would have thought, you know, uh, for a small subscriber channel like mine, if you would have told me I could have got some Knipix tools sent to me, I, I, it just blows my mind. So really appreciative. I want to thank Knipix a lot, but let's get this box open. Let's find out what's in it. Mm -hmm. I guess I'll hold, I'm going to hold the box off to the side over here pull things out one at a time so you can't see them so first tool that i'm going to pull out of here is six and a quarter step cut cable shears i don't have a pair of those been looking forward to those they've got a nice cutting uh, teeth on there it's got that step cut on them so we're going to be able to now use these to cut some cables instead of maybe using the shears on my you know electrician's uh, installation pliers or my 
forged wire strippers if i know that i'm going to cut something that i need to cut especially i think this works really well on cables where you got more than one cable inside the sheathing like that uh, so looking forward to using that so we got some six and a quarter step cut cable shears let me know if you've got these in the comments below uh, what you think about those also got some eight inch cobalt bolt cutters with notch blade uh, these were on my short list of things to get matter of fact they're in my amazon wish list and i love the eight inch because again i'm i'm a big fan of you know the smaller versions of the tools and again i know that's not for everybody that's because of what i do i like them to fit my tool bag better i don't and i never work on things where i need you know 14 inch 16 inch pliers or anything like that i just don't need those kinds of things 12 inches is about you know the biggest pair of pliers that i might would even use and those are only on rare occasions so again let me know in the comments below if you've got a pair of those what you think about those big knippic sticker that's going to look awesome on my toolbox i've already got one that's a little bit smaller than this but now i've got all my toolboxes here at home i needed another one of these might even look nice on something up in here we'll see but that's awesome love stickers i'm always a big fan of getting those We got the Swedish pipe wrench with that quick adjust. I can't, I think that's the exact name of it. I can't, I don't know off the top of my head, but I'm pretty sure that's right. But the part number is 8361015. I believe that's the 16 inch version. Uh, so that's going to be super nice. That's going to replace pretty much probably any pipe wrench that I have. Cause again, I don't get into needing huge pipe wrenches. I don't do a lot of big uh, pipe work or anything like that. This is probably going to be all i would ever need in this size right here and it's got that quick adjust i don't have any of these at all haven't had a pair uh, so let me know in the comments below if you've got any of these what you think about them i know i had a subscriber a while back on one of my videos asked me and i can't remember i'd have to go back and search if i had any of these and what i thought about them so we'll be able to find out now uh, we'll see what, how these work out but again let us know in the comments below if you've got a set of these what you think about those how well they work for you uh interested to hear what you think Got a little card from them showing you how it's pronounced, K Nip X. Uh, I had a hard time at the beginning of that. I used to always call them Nipix, but I've learned different. I still catch myself saying it wrong all the time, uh, but I've, I've kind of got the hang of it a little bit, but I might still every now and then slip up, but that's just me. That's how I am. Uh, and then let's see what else we got in here. Also got a t-shirt. Pretty nice. Get to have the swag of wearing the Knipix t-shirt around. That's going to allow people to say, to me what's that because i get that all the time with my knipix tools and i love the fact that i can you know turn people on to those tools and let them know about them as well and you got that cobra wrapped up with that snake so again love the fact that uh again it just blows my mind that a company like knipix would send somebody like me some tools for this channel uh, for me to review and, and to give my thoughts on i would have never guessed this and, I, and again, I can't thank you guys enough because this doesn't happen unless you guys subscribe and unless you guys like the videos, you know, and then that makes other people watch them and then subscribe. Uh, again, I, I'm just honored. I'm blessed. And I really, really, really appreciate each and every one of you. And again, it's because y'all do that. I get to get tools like this. I get to share them with you. You get to know my feedback on it. And hopefully it helps you in some way. I know everybody else's videos that I watch, I grab little nuggets from those and I find out and think to myself, well, is that going to work for me? And, and without that, you got to do a lot more trial and error, a lot more cost involved in that. So I think YouTube's a great thing for this. But again, thanks all you guys. Let me know in the comments below uh, which one of these that you think that you would use the most uh, out of all these. But again, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to put them to use. We'll do some reviews on these things eventually. This is kind of an unboxing, but again, thank you, Knipix. Uh, I, I'm I'm so grateful. I think it's awesome. I, I never would have thought that you guys would have even thought about sending me something, but I really, really appreciate it. That just shows me what a company that y'all are. And again, I've been so impressed with your tools. I can't say enough about them, but again, like the video, comment down below, subscribe if you haven't. Hope that you guys stay safe, have a blessed day, and I'll see you on the next video.